amidst health concerns including the King Charles's undisclosed cancer treatment and Princess Catherine's recovery from abdominal surgery, have inevitably left gaps in their usual busy schedules, both in public appearances and charitable endeavors. Despite these challenges, Prince William and Queen Camilla have admirably maintained their steadfast commitment to royal duties. As the royal family navigates through this period, all eyes will be on the upcoming Commonwealth Day on March 11. Commonwealth Day is poised to serve as a significant litmus test for the state of the British monarchy. As an occasion that unites working members of the royal family, it invites heightened scrutiny, especially in light of recent health concerns surrounding key figures. Given the uncertainty surrounding King Charles III and the Princess of Wales' ability to attend due to their health conditions, the significance of Queen Camilla and Prince William's roles cannot be overstated. Their actions and demeanor on Commonwealth Day will undoubtedly shape perceptions of the monarchy's resilience and continuity in the face of adversity. At last year's Commonwealth Day, King Charles emphasized values of peace, justice, tolerance, and environmental care, outlining his vision for the future of the Commonwealth. With its vast population, he aims to tackle pressing issues like climate change, biodiversity loss, youth education, global health, and economic cooperation through collective action among member nations. This occasion not only celebrates the monarchy's ties with various nations, but also serves as a barometer of public confidence in the royal family. With the exception of Prince William's absence at a recent memorial service due to personal reasons, both Prince William and Queen Camilla have remained dedicated to their responsibilities in the month since their spouses were hospitalized. The absence of Prince William at the memorial service led to further speculation about Princess Catherine's health and whereabouts, though Kensington Palace clarified it as a personal matter. Experts note that Prince William and Queen Camilla have managed their roles without conveying overwhelming strain, thanks in part to the support of extended family members. Despite the weight of King Charles's health crisis, both Prince William and Queen Camilla maintain a sense of normalcy in their duties. Psychologists suggest that while the royal family may be experiencing stress and grief privately, they are not immune to the human experience of dealing with health struggles and mortality. The challenges they face mirror those of any family managing multiple responsibilities during a loved one's illness. Looking ahead, Prince William is expected to face a busy schedule, balancing personal and public commitments, while Camilla remains visible in public, reassuring the public about the king's well-being. Psychotherapist Dr. Victor Kidd emphasizes that despite their royal status, the royal family experiences stress and grief like anyone else. The contributions of other working members of the royal family have been instrumental in maintaining the monarchy's public profile. From Princess Anne's extensive overseas travel to Edward and Sophie's charitable patronages, the royal family continues to operate as a cohesive unit. Looking ahead, the coming months may present additional challenges for Prince William and Queen Camilla as the royal calendar fills with events and engagements. In the absence of Charles III, state advisors such as Queen Camilla and Prince William are responsible for crucial royal duties. Prince William and Queen Camilla will likely have additional responsibilities as the royal garden party season begins and the number of public receptions at royal palaces increases. However, their commitment to their roles remains unwavering despite the circumstances.